we're so close. The signal's coming from just beyond this ridge. Stay on the lookout. You see any movement, run. Sit tight, people. I'm gonna clear the way. It's time for some answers. Hmm. What do we have here? Zahidi, I found some more writing from Monroy's people. I think we must be approaching their colony. It seems Monroy didn't believe the peaceful. When their text started getting fried, he suspected the packs were trying to sabotage him. Then, just as a storm was brewing up, they caught the Pax doing one of their obelisk rituals. Did Monroy think the Pax were causing the storm? I, uh, thought the same thing when I first saw August in those ruins in the forest. Monroy ordered his soldiers to stop them. It was on that day that Dr. Indira recorded the first Pax deaths. Please, collect all the writing you can find for me. Perhaps we can learn their story. big storms burned out most of their tech. Sounds like Monroy got furious. He demanded explanations from the Pax and access to their powers. But they didn't understand. They offered everything they could. They led Monroy through the jungle to their sacred city. Probably this city. The place we've discovered.
Pax took him to the Grand Temple, tried to show him how they communed with the anomaly. But Minroy thought it was a ploy to assassinate. He ordered the executions of the Pax leaders and locked down the temple. There are countless cages here. They're filled with skeletons. They look like past After they'd executed the Pax leaders, Roy's people started moving into the city. So this was their colony. They took over the homes of the Pax, forcing them to work for them, to serve them. In other words, they made them slaves. They believed the loss of their machinery was the Pax's fault. It doesn't matter what they believe. There's no excuse for enslaving another race. There's got to be hundreds of dead packs here, executed, piled up. This whole city is a mass grave. Monroy's people, they did this. I think it's getting real clear who the packs were scared of, who they changed themselves into pharaohs to protect themselves from. This place, it was a slave market. Seems like they got hit by the worst storm yet. Hundreds died, 
humans and packs. Some of the obelisks were damaged too, so... Whatever the packs once were doing to control the storms, they couldn't do it anymore. He feared an uprising, losing control, as packs started to abandon the city. Uh, Nikolai Galyavkin. When Roy made him general, and put him in charge of weapons production. No doubt the same weapons the Pharaohs used against them later. Min Roy, this palace is covered with flags, all with... It's got a nice face. A king! A tyrant. Clear. Monroy was sending out raids to hunt down the fleeing packs. And that's when the uprising he predicted finally found him. But it wasn't the packs. At least, as he expected. The Pharaoh. He never saw them coming. But Monroy didn't retreat. That asshole dug in, out there in the desert, and tried to track them down, where they were coming from. That's when he found the canyon and the great obelisk. He finally understood there who the Pharaohs were. That's when he got word of the city was under attack. And so it was the beginning. I've made it to the top. Palace is clear. What do you see? You better come up here and see for yourself. This Monroy was a madman. Hey, there's a ship! Is that... the Caravel? That's not possible. Caravel never left Earth. Its engines exploded. Tens of thousands died. Then what the hell are we looking at? The source of the fucking signal. Monroy's signal. There's no place beyond the storm. It's coming from in there, protected from the anomaly, just like the uplink in your goddamn briefcase. I don't fucking understand. Neither do I. 
It doesn't make any sense. Everyone saw the caravel explode during its construction. Even if the people left on Earth were able to rebuild the ship, they left after us. We were the first. Nevertheless, what's certain is that Monroy enslaved August's people. He butchered them, and they turned. They mutated into savages willingly, so they could fight back. I'm done with all this. Whatever's waiting for you on that ship, I want no part of it. Tiago, you can't leave us now. I thought you weren't a deserter. What they did to August's people. What our people did to August, don't you see? Thank you for letting me walk away with you. We're going to finish this. We're finding a way into the caravel. This is it now. That ship, the signal, the garden. I'm ready to make all this. We'll leave on your word, Outrider.